Hello guys and welcome back to my channel Civil Construction and Tutor and in this video we'll be unboxing and reviewing Echo Pro Medium from XP Paint. So basically I'll be explaining whether this pen tablet is uh, suitable for a beginner like me or not. So let us see. So now let us connect the pain tablet to laptop using this USB cable. Now let us download the driver. So you can simply search in Google and download it from the website of the XP Pen. So once it is downloaded, you can simply extract the setup file. And now let us install this. Okay, I agree the agreement. Next. So once it is installed, you can simply go and use the pen tablet. So once it is installed, you can simply run this pen tablet and you can see here different options so pain setting if you want to change the shortcut keys of the pain style uh, so the shortcut keys provided are the stylus so you can simply customize this and select what you want to do with it and with the shortcut keys provided at the pain tablet itself so here you can see k1 k2 and so the shortcut assigned are shown here you can simply customize over here and the roller touch one is the mechanical wheel and another is the virtual wheel So now I want to write on a PDF. Okay, then what I have to do is 
so this is a trick okay you can find another trick as well so now let me uh, take this PDF and I have to write over it then I will open this with okay just go and open this and print this as one note for Windows 10 okay we will open this with Windows that is one note so okay So IS1893 part 1 2016. Now you can write on it. Just go to draw and select the pin. So now you can write. Okay, just take the pin to the point where you want to write. For example, I want to write over here. Okay, let me select this Indian standard. So now you can see I can select this and with the same nib I can apply different pressure. For example, this is the lightest. If I do if I press a little bit more like this if more then a bit more so like this you can also vary the thickness with the pressure you can also write directly on a PDF but it is not that user friendly as compared to uh, OneNote so just go to comment and here you can see pencil select that and you can just uh, go to the point where you want to select okay, like this you can do but the writing is not that easy I think okay so, it is quite user friendly to write in one note what if you have to write in the desktop so if you want to write directly on desktop then we have uh, another app you can find that uh, by searching in google and simply install it so i am using epic pen you can find that it is free so just select the pen and you want the color you want to go okay, let me use this so you can simply write over now Okay. so let us write uh, subscribe to civil construction and tutor so you can directly write on desktop and to erase this you can go over here okay. the only drawback is that we have to select the cursor to go to the uh, regular use of the mouse that is to cancel this I have to select this cursor and if I am to write this we have shortcut key as well but the easiness that we get in one note is not available here you can directly write on PDF as well so for example if this is a PDF and I want to write over here okay, let me delete this first okay let me write over here also you can simply write over here there is no problem okay but it won't move with respect to this as it will do on one note because it is particularly on, at one page but we are writing on a desktop so this is only for writing on a particular page and for desktop not for pdf as a overall use so i hope this video helped you and if it did help do like and subscribe our channel